What's up, nerd amigos? I'm a Jive talking to John Norgrove. We've got Wife here. We're here for another review, Jive. The chickens are freaking out. They're just ignore them. They're having a moment. They're doing Somebody chicken just laid stuff. an egg. Yeah, they freaked the fuck the out about song. that kind of stuff. So, last night, we watched the movie Killing, Killing Gunther. Gunther. And Killing Gunther is... I was prepared for an action comedy movie that was just kind of kind of be like stupid and funny and like, fart jokey. Kind of like red. Because, but well, like not, more not, yeah, well, just not as good. I yeah. mean, in reality, when you watch, when you watch the trailer, when you watch the trailer on Netflix, we watch this on Netflix, we watch the trailer on Netflix and it was just kind of like, all right, well, like, this looks like it's going to be like, I mean, really, it looked like fart joke action comedy. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it looked really just like sort of shitty action comedy. And let mm -hmm. me tell you what. It's pretty fart jokey, but it is also profoundly yeah. funny. It was very good. It what is the thing? violent as shit. Yeah. Holy fuck, I was not prepared for yeah, that. It was I, super violent. Is this rated R? No, I don't they don't show ratings on here. They do on one of these. It's not important. I would not be surprised anyway, if it was rated R. So the description. Robert Gunther Bendick is, a, is renowned as the world's greatest hitman. A group of self-obsessed self assassins, wow, wow, team up to take Gunther out, <laughs> determined to claim the title for themselves. So, Gunther is played by Arnold Schwarzenegger, who you do not see until, like... The last the third of the may movie. Not, maybe even the last third. Yeah. Maybe and, even less but than But you that. don't even know what he looks like. People are just, like, talking about him. They're, like, telling yeah. stories that they no heard clue. about well, Gunther. And, and they're, like, they do this thing where they story tell with, like, redacted files and with, like, news clippings and so stuff. So it's kind of like between. a mockumentary. Well, yeah. Oh, yeah. also, the most genius part of this movie is the fact that this movie is a follow cam movie. Yeah. This movie is, the camera is a living being. Yeah. Several living beings within the, the universe that they're in getting like blown up and shot at and stuff like that. Yeah. It is fucking amazing. It's so good that sometimes you forget the camera's a person until either the person behind the camera screams because some motherfucker just got shot in the head. Yeah. Right? Like, real <laughs> viscerally. Or when the, like, bad guy's just like, all right, we're gonna fucking blah, 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 blah. And he's like, all right, no, hold on. Okay. Okay. All right, guys, so we're gonna, like, because he, like, he's, like, directs the camera. It's fucking insane, it's dude. It's so funny. It's so oh good. Oh, my gosh. There's a, there is a fight scene at the end of this movie where, um, like, there's a bunch of cameras that are unmanned, and the fight scene is just, like, a camera sitting here on the counter pointing that way, and they're fighting near the fridge, and then, like, there's another camera, like, on the ground, and it shows their feet scuffling around. Yeah. And there's, like, another camera on its side over here that, yeah. as he throws him over the countertop, he, like, kicks the camera, and it flips onto a yeah. lounge chair, and now it's facing this way to get the perfect shot. Like... <laughs> It's fucking insane that the cameras are like real things that they have to address and they address them both in this very physical way of like, no, look over here. Don't stop rolling the camera. Like, yeah. you know, physically grabbing, like reaching behind frame and like moving something. Right. But then they also have this like the cameras are always just sort of perfectly facing the right direction. Yeah. You know, it's. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so fucking great. It really takes, like, follow cam, like, yeah. first person kind of movies to, and like, a whole nother level. It takes it way up It takes level. it way beyond. It is even, even, the, even, like, the mockumentary style Honestly, of things, I think this is the really best cool. follow cam, cameras a character yeah. um, movie of all of them by a fucking considerable yeah. margin. Because it's just, it's, there's just a little bit where you're like, is it, though? Is it? Like, is it always in there? Like, sometimes you forget that you're in that kind of movie. Yeah, you and really And then somebody do. addresses it, and you're just like, oh, and then you're like, my oh, God. Oh, that's yeah. right. That's what we're doing here. It's ah. really, really yeah. good at yeah, that. Yeah, it's really uh, good Oh, that. my fucking God. At one point in time, they're like, the camera, like, as it's panning past, got a single frame of the guy. And they're like, that's it. That's the frame. Zoom in on the face. Enhance that shit. And the like, their nerd is just <laughs> like, like the nerd guy is like that's, that's not, not how, how this that works. works. And he's like, you see it all the time on the TV. They just enhance it. And he's like, and he's like, yeah, that's not how I that can't. works. I can't do that. <laughs> it's so fucking. <laughs> it and they're like, so funny. like the Asian guy or whatever is just like, he's just like, you know, I, I, I think he might be right. 
I, I think we might not be able to do this. And they're just like, no, 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 no. I saw it on NCIS. I swear. Like, it's, it's fucking insane. This so movie is so crazy. So all of these hitmen are like a different, all these hitmen that are trying to kill guns oh, are yeah. all like a different kind of hitman too. So there's like the nerd, they're like, like hacker character hitman guy. device hit Yeah, people. there's like the girl who's, there's like the there's girl. There's like the sexy girl. Yeah, she's like the daughter. Femme fatale. And she's yeah. the daughter of like, like some of like drug a drug lord. Terrorist. Like terrorist or kind of guy. Whatever. And the dad is just like hanging around with her and he's like, I'm so proud of you, my daughter. Oh yeah, it's he's just like a fun so background funny. character. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's like, like the, there's guy like the who Russian does, twins yeah, that are Russian just twins. like idiots. There's the guy who does like all like different face stuff and like masks and disguises. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, there's yeah. a whole bunch like every the, kind of like the explosion assassin guy. Type. There's the guy there's with some sort of sci-fi shit. Yeah. There's the guy who's like like very articulate and like I don't use guns because that's messy and that's not real real murder or whatever. Yeah. Like yeah. that guy who and there's like arguably the is one of my favorite guy. guys because anytime he doesn't like guns and the sight of blood makes him throw up, but perfectly. I mean, like, every time somebody gets shot, he's like, oh, what's that? Blah! What was that, man? And he just, like, lets a little bit out and then finishes what he was saying, and nobody fucking addresses him. It's just... It was so like, good. Like, dude, you just throwing up all over the fucking place, too. He's yeah. just constantly just, like, a little bit of fucking throat. And yeah. he, he doesn't use guns. He uses little vials of poison. And he's constantly, like, he'll be like, cover me, and, like, run into gun, like into like gunfire and like throw a bottle of poison and duck back. I don't think he successfully poisons anybody. I don't by think the he successfully poisons which anybody. Which is great. Either. He's he's probably my favorite. There's character. also like the ninja guy. Uh, yeah. And then there's he's a like few doing others. flips over shit and stuff. Oh, yeah. It's so so like great, every man. like assassin all the, all the trope, tropes they're all are there. like in there. All like the all like the the things the tropes that you would see in those assassin movies are all there. Yeah. You the got the your sniping bomb, and you got the car and bomb the fucking, and you yeah. got the double cross. You yeah, know. It's got the old and, guy. Yeah. It's got you know, the old guy. Oh my god. Poor the fucking old guy. The best. Oh man. So this movie both felt like it took a really long time to watch because there was so much that happened oh my but god also yeah it not feels like a super all. long movie and then the movie's over and you're just like and you're just like wait that's it? it we're you already know? done yeah you know it's, it, it has so that most good. like it's only four o'clock and it's already four o'clock yeah. kind of aspect like, it, re it really it did together. it really did yeah, yeah. I mean, and it had this crazy all-star cast. Oh, and then they, they do, they, they interview uh, one of Gunther's ex-girlfriends. Yeah. Uh, who's, uh, what, Kobe? Kobe, Kobe Smolders. Kobe, Smol Kobe Smolders. Yeah. And she's like, I'm not gonna give him up. Like, she's like, she's like, I'll tell you about him, but, like, I'm not gonna, like, rat him out kind of thing. Yeah. And she's just sort of, like, in the movie at a few random points, Yeah, too. Well, and, and they have hilarious. that, like, sit-down interview thing, and, and they have that, like, where, like... <laughs> They'll, like, address some shit in the future. They're just like, so what did you think about this? You yeah, know, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, they do such a great job. Okay, so so I just want to go over some quick casting on this. So Arnold Schwarzenegger is Gunther. He's fucking Hilarious. majestic in this. Oh, my god, He is so good. Also, so every good. line you want him to say is Arnold Schwarzenegger in a movie right now about action. He yeah. says... Everything you want him to do, he does. Yeah. It is so it's fucking so meta. Self aware. They even talk about him getting to the chopper. Yeah, he's just like he got to the chopper. Ugh. Yeah, you know, <laughs> I, I will terminate you. Like all of it, it's fucking it's all there. insane, it's dude. All and there. every time you're just like, oh. You fucking know that I'm fucking amped that <laughs> yeah, you know you're like, that you did I that. See you. you fucking son of a bitch. Like, it's so great. And he, and the, the character he plays in the movie of Gunther is just like the most jovial old man. He, yeah. He's just, he's always in like a little sweater and he's just like talking to the camera like, yeah, guys. Okay. So like, blah, 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 and he's like doing this like, fu yeah. he's like so happy. Yeah. Which is insane right and he's like the greatest murderer of all time and shit yeah. like that i love when they do the jump cut to shit where he's just like he was like he was like what they don't know is that i was you know the lady at the bar and it just shows some chick at the bar not not at all arnold schwarzenegger right just like some 32 year old blonde lady and she's like at the bar like talking to whatever the fuck and then like it'll like he'll either turn and wink at the camera or He'll like he'll like get up and like walk out of the room and then like pull off like pull like off do the like, like pull off a rubber yeah. mask and then it's grown ass adult Arnold Schwarzenegger in like a small dress 
tight on his body with just a mask in and like hair that was in his hair. clearly not the same Which person like, that you just what? saw. It's so fucking it's funny. So and they do funny. it like nine yeah, times. Yeah, they do it a lot. It's, it's so really hilarious good. because it's like everything under the sun. It doesn't matter. You yeah. can like perfectly affect all accents and voices. Yeah, yeah. It's so fucking great. We had a blast yeah. watching uh, this. Taryn Gilliam is in this. Hannah Simon. Kobe Smulders, obviously. Uh, Bobby Moynihan. Uh, yeah, dude. Just Amir Tal... Uh, uh, Tons of people where you see them and you're like, oh, it's you're that like, guy. I totally know that guy. Yeah. I totally know that guy. I totally know that guy. A lot of that. It's awesome, dude. So, yeah. like, I mean, this is one of those movies. It's certainly not kid friendly. This yeah. was incredibly violent. Yeah. Um, yeah. Very it, violent. It wasn't very gory, gory, but there was a lot of blood. Like, it wasn't yeah. like viscera, ah, you know, like yeah, war movie yeah, gory. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it, but it was bloody. It was very yeah. bloody. Um and you know, like a ton of adult humor. Yeah. So this is like deaf, not family yeah. friendly, but um. But you know what? If you, you want, should watch. If you it. want like a funny, you want kind like of a good. Like, yeah, you break want like a like a, like a break from reality. You yeah. want like a summer blockbuster yeah. kind of a movie. That's this movie. Yeah. Go watch this. This movie. is. It's just. It's a. It's really. It feels like one of those like just fun summer 80s action movies that we used to that we used to get yeah you know where it's just like it's just like this guy has to save the world because this guy's a bad guy and you're yeah. like all right whatever like there's no explanation there's no fucking logic who cares it's just yeah. fun and a lot of people are getting shot in the head or like missiled yeah. or stabbed yeah. we were basically laughing or like oh man or like the shocked. whole time the whole movie the yeah whole time. it was so great it was I so mean, good like like, I have to give this five out of five. Five out of five. Yeah. Solid. This was no question such about it. a great. This let me tell you what. These last watch. couple of movies that we've that we found have been fucking bang up, dude. Yeah. Netflix, get your get your fucking trailer game together, dog. Because your trailers this, aren't reflecting the movies right like, now. Honestly, <laughs> I watched the trailer for this and I was just like, oh, I remember seeing trailers for this like before it came out. Yeah. To movies or whatever, like like before it came out, and I was just like, all right, this kind of looks. Dumb. I mean, really, honestly, the way that the trailer was shot, it feels like it's just one of those hangover movies. And they're not yeah. bad movies, but, like, it's just, like, a dumb comedy. Oh, this one's about murders. Whatever. I yeah, don't care. Yeah, or, like, care. super bad, where you, you know? watch it and you're like, well, I don't know that I ever really need to watch that again. Yeah, I, like, honestly wasn't expecting it to be this good. And having watched it, I'm like, this is now on the list of, like, people are over and we want to put on a fun movie this is the movie we're going to put yeah. on because it's just, it's absurd. You don't really have to pay that much attention. You can kind of jump into any scene and it, and it's fair game. Yeah. You know, it just, it's honestly totally. a fucking good movie. Absolute five out of five, dude. Yeah, totally. Arnold Watch this movie. The motherfucking governor, dude. Yeah. Killing it again. Killing this guy's it. always killing, killing it. Always fucking so, killing uh, it. So, uh, like, share, comment, subscribe. Like, have you subscribe. seen this? Tell us what you think. Do you have anything that you think we would enjoy? Yeah. Let us know in the we comments. We do have some movies that were suggested to us, but that we have to, like, rent, so... Yeah, and we just haven't gotten around to it yet because we're lazy and broke or yeah. cheap. Uh, yeah, so uh, we'll see you guys Six of one, half dozen of the other. <laughs> see you guys on the flip side.